Hey everybody and welcome. My name is Dan and this... It's my chop shop. And welcome or welcome back to Dan's Chop Shop. You can see I've, I've already started this one and I, I banded it and went, went to something different. But I'm going to do it this time. My niece uh, inherited a 71 Roadrunner from her when her dad died in a car accident when she was a kid. It's been sitting for 30 years but hey they finally collected a, they got a 426 off. Assem not assembled, but they got all the parts, and uh, they're going to get her back on the road, which I look forward to seeing. But I'm going to add a little thing or two to this one. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make a big old zinger or muscle machine, whatever you want to call it, out of it. And uh, this ought to be fun. So you can see I already got the pattern drawn out on the hood. So here we go. Well, I got my holes drilled. Now I'll just use the jeweler saw and uh, play connected dots. Right here it is. It's kind of mocked up. I still got to get the, the interior and the when the glass to fit in there. Engine hole. I'm going to tilt that engine back a little bit. But it's getting there, but I got a lot of work to do still. And uh, we're ready to paint. Now, uh, her car was painted like 30 years ago and it was a, a light blue metallic so that's what I'm gonna try to emulate so if I guess silver sealer and then we'll go into the the blue little mixture of uh, Caribbean blue balancing clear and some cosmic sparkle and then a little bit of thinner hopefully it's not too blue but it'll be it'll be fine My niece's 71 Roadrunner, maybe on steroids, but I think it turned out pretty cool. I hope you did too. Thank you for watching. Uh, can't say enough that this is a, a monumental car that hopefully in my lifetime will get finished. But hey, what happens happens. Life throws curveballs all the time, doesn't it? Thanks again. See you down the road. And uh, what do you say, cat?